In this video, we are going to check this sunscreen that I got from Mintra. First of all, I was really happy when I saw this on Mintra because if they are selling it on Mintra, that means it is original. So this is a Korean sunscreen and I'm not really into Korean skincare and all. And I'm also not into very thin and watery textured sunscreens because I want my sunscreen to be either 100% mineral or hybrid but I don't like my sunscreens to be completely chemical because that makes me feel like it has no protection so I want my sunscreen to be thicker so this Korean sunscreen from Suntec called I am pure they have few more sunscreens but I like this one because it's 100% mineral so that is why it was exciting for me and I'm also gonna show you my favorite sunscreens that I use these days and all these sunscreens that I use are tested in different labs so you guys can trust these sunscreens so let's talk about the packaging and everything so the packaging is very sleek and glassy I mean I love the packaging of Korean products they always have cute packaging and for this sunscreen on the packaging they always advertise that it is synthetic fragrance free but when you look at the ingredients list at the end it says fragrance I don't know what that means please let me know what it means because I don't know what that means is it like um, natural fragrance like I don't know what they mean by that but it smells like something that fades away very quickly but when you apply it it doesn't smell like anything I'm really bad at describing perfume and how the product smells but just know that the smell fades away so I don't think you will be bothered with that at least I am not bothered with that there are two filters in this sunscreen one is zinc oxide and another one is titanium dioxide so those are two mineral filters in this sunscreen also I should mention that I always want to go for a fragrance free sunscreen because I also apply it around my eyes and I have sensitive eyes and it shouldn't burn my eyes while applying this on my face it feels very thin a lot thinner than any other sunscreen that I have tried before also it does not burn or sting my eyes which is very good it has liquidy and thin texture that I mentioned already. It is SPF 50 plus PA 4 plus. So you know that it is very good at protecting your skin. Also, it was tested in the lab that I'm gonna show on the screen and it successfully passed the test. It didn't just pass the test, but the SPF and PA value was higher than what they mentioned on the packaging. Another thing is that it is very waterproof. Very waterproof? Yes, very waterproof. And I love that for summer because all the other sunscreens that I have tried do not have this ability to be this strong at being waterproof. So I would love it for summer, but the white cast is horrible as you can see. If you are my skin tone, this is why I'm making this video. So you do not waste your money on this sunscreen. I would love this sunscreen a lot if it didn't have this much of white cast. Also, I don't know why it's balling on my face because all I applied under this is Formula RX Barrier Plus Moisturizer which is very thin and I just applied a little bit of that. So I don't know why it's balling. I don't blame this sunscreen for balling up on my skin because it does not ball up on other people. I'm also applying it around my eye and now I'm gonna show you my face after 20 minutes of applying this and this is how it looks after 20 minutes of applying this sunscreen still the same in my opinion and trust me it is not gonna get better than this because I have used it multiple times before filming this video and here is the waterproof test I love it it is very good at being waterproof and I would use it around my mouth area because when I drink water after applying the sunscreen my sunscreen just comes off and I hate that feeling but this one is waterproof so it's good to apply around your mouth area they mention on their packaging it's ocean friendly and all and that's that's amazing overall my experience with this sunscreen is that it has very thin texture it spreads well and it doesn't irritate my eyes it's 50 plus PA4 pluses. It passed the lab test. 
with higher value than they advertise it is a hundred percent mineral sunscreen it is waterproof so i love everything about it but it has horrible white cast so that's the only downside of this sunscreen otherwise i would highly recommend this one and it's tough to wear it outside because i'm gonna look like a clown in fact i did that and when i came back home i could not believe how shitty i looked so i'm not gonna ever wear this sunscreen outside but if you have fair skin if you think it can go well on your skin by looking at my skin tone then you can go for this but just know that it has horrible white cast if you use little bit you use more doesn't matter it is gonna give you white cast so that's it thank you so much for watching and no one is subscribing to my channel that's okay that's okay but that will be great if you subscribe and like this video. Bye.